Hello, Masaki Universe, and now to something completely different. Um, I recently, and you will see the unpacking of it very, very soon, I recently made a pretty big order from France, thanks to some fidgeting and, you know, uh, of course, prompting the question, am I staying within my budget? Will it be fine staying in, within my budget? And um, the way the conversation went and we making a grant proclamation uh, led to me with my wife, my dear wife, led to me actually figuring, I think we should record this and put it on YouTube just to have everyone know. These are my plans with my collection for this year, a little bit going ahead. How is it going with my budget? Will I stay within my budget? And yeah, do I have a problem? So enjoy those few <laughs> minutes of me and my wife talking about my jersey potential addiction. Okay, so Roland, I want you to tell me a little bit um, about your financial plan. Um, planning on buying shirts and uh, how, uh, how much money uh, for the year and uh, what are your plans in spending? Yep, so we said my roughly, my budget roughly is 120 a month. Then uh, thanks to you being an awesome wife, you allowed me to go a little bit overboard in April by taking an additional 240 that I can pull from other months to spend in April, which I spent on a lot of German shirts. So basically in April, you uh, had the money for three months. Yes. Right, because the, um, it, the market was so that... Uh, exactly, at the moment there are the sales and it is uh, only spending 120 is really limiting. And to be honest, I am so, uh, for the channel, I really want to get shirts to be really have a good variety. It's I'm, uh, I'm trying to buy a lot of shirts for teams that I don't own currently. Mm -hmm. uh, and this is kind of my goal. And yeah, I have this vision. I think I have it now for almost any type of video. I'm quite well, but there are still some wants and so on that are always there. But as we said, my my real plan is, I know I went over budget for the for April, mm -hmm. where I know I have to make this money, I have to make this up. Mm -hmm. I know that. Uh, the good thing is, and so far I am within budget for this month just about. Uh, so, uh, normally I would have gone over budget already. <laughs> <laughs> but with some lucky things I could do that. Uh, I mean, the first one is I got the, we have the Venezia shirt right here. Uh, this was um, part of the budget, which leaves me a little bit uh, over for which I think I got, no, uh, which, which, which leaves me a little bit over. Then I made now this huge order from France for about 180. However, there I'm saved by the fact that my work gave me 150 in coupons where graciously you agreed to take over 100 so that I can go uh, and buy stuff. <laughs> and you take the 100 for the mall that we got the stuff for. Mm -hmm. And so I'm just within budget for this month. Okay. Yeah. Uh, I had some silent hope that I could maybe make uh, that I could make up some money already, but let's face it, it's not gonna happen. <sighs> so um, I really would like that for June and July I don't spend. Mm -hmm. Is it tempting? Do they have stuff? It's very, very tempting. They came out, for instance, with this beauty the other day, which is mm -hmm. the perfect non shirt that I. That's a, that is a non that is the launcher that I've been really really wanting for that mm -hmm. that 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 type for a long long time. They just came came out with it at a reasonable price for sixty five, mm -hmm. which is uh, 
it's you know letting that go then there are other like uh the yeah the two or three more that would be really tempted to think where i'm actually hoping that nike comes up mm -hmm. with some more discounts that i could pounce on but you know it is i'm a mess i'm a mess but i really would like that you know I know I could probably, if I restrict myself for four months to the end of the year to only have the budget, I would be all right again. I also said that I want to get one Belgian jersey for the Euros, which I found one for 20 bucks. And then that's that. So, so basically you already have a few ideas for uh, things that you need? I honestly, to be honest, in all, I have the feeling I am so in such trouble. I should stay for two months off the internet. <laughs> no, I mean, uh, the, the big trouble for me is that at the moment they are slashing prices. And since I want to build the collection, especially mm -hmm. for the channel, yes, I get very, very tempted. Uh, I get less tempted very often towards the end of the year. That's very true. Mm -hmm. Where I'm typically spending you know, where I'm fine and I'm getting to the point where I'm, where I'm actually quite content with my collection. Mm -hmm. But I still see some things where I could improve on. By that meaning that you still see yeah, certain things, things that you that can add, add to the on. collection? Uh, I said this year I don't want to really buy collection pieces, meaning jerseys that I've been longing for for a long time. I really want to add new teams. Mm -hmm. For I think once I've done that and I'm really feel confident with my, that you know, whatever the channel throws up, I can put a short, mm -hmm. uh, corresponding short on. Yes. Then I would be really happy and that I might only then for the upcoming years need to buy a one or two at most per season mm -hmm. for new teams. And I can really focus on shirts that I've been longing for for a long time where I can actually also wait because some of them might be more expensive or, you know, when they pop up. Mm -hmm. That's, this is how I see it, see it going. I know we just hit 200 or 201. Is space is also becoming an issue. You mean the number of shirts is yes. 200? Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's be clear, this mm -hmm. 120 per month mm -hmm. that we have allocated, this is uh, your spent money for anything you like, need and want to have, but you invest it uh, purely in, short, in shirts, you don't have any, any other things that you need to buy and you want to buy, uh, it is uh, for your channel. For my channel at this very moment. Okay. And um, when we talk about some presents, like for Father's Day or a birthday or That's some extra. other special day, those things are uh, extra. Yes. Yes. And those there I usually pick, although I know that the Father's Day present you give me will be, it's a ni really nice shirt that you guys are going to get me, but it also will fit nicely because it's a team I don't have yet. So, I mean, it's, it's double. Okay. Where is, uh, for instance, this, the Venezia jersey, or the, the Ajax jersey you got me, this was more or less a collection mm -hmm. uh, jersey because uh, this is really, I have Ajax jerseys, but this was special, so in that case. Mm -hmm. yeah. So it is pretty clear to everyone that... Uh, I have a problem. Everything uh, <laughs> that you... Um, I did not... Uh, <laughs> uh, that uh, uh, every uh, cent that you have, you would spend for... For a jersey. I'm going, and I'm so bad that I'm foregoing haircuts because those 20 bucks can be invested into jerseys. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because we need to stay within budget. Exactly. And now, um, and the kids are already saying, uh, whenever they see a piece of money or say, uh, da -da, Papa, you don't spend this on jerseys. So they already know. They only know your um, they already know slight it. addiction. I'm, I'm trying to gauge whether this is um, uh, something that's now um, that will be permanent for life, or is this something because of your excitement for making the channel? I've been asking myself that as well, but I think at the moment it is really exciting of building something. Okay. I don't have a goal of getting to 1,000 jerseys. 
Okay. For instance, I think the maximum that I could justify, the maximum that I can justify, 365. The number of shirts. Yes, meaning a jersey a day. Okay, and I just. But I'm, 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 I don't really want to go. I, I don't want to set myself uh, such a number. But I also see that I think the number 200 that I have at the moment, in itself, is already rather ridiculous. When you say, uh, uh, just a moment, mm. when you say a jersey a day, you mean a jersey a day to wear every to wear, day, different, exactly. uh -huh. not to buy, yes. right? No, no. Uh, yeah, because it did. <laughs> <laughs> no, a jersey to wear a jersey a day, and yes, there are a few here that I am avoiding to wear. They're almost museum pieces mm -hmm. at the moment. Either they're too small or they have some damaged stuff on there. Uh, which would be fun to make wavy with and how to repair this, which is something that eventually I want to get into. Okay. Yeah. So since we have discussed this as a family and yes. uh, we have no problem with you making this investment, 120 mm -hmm. per month for mm -hmm. the year, yeah. so that you can build up your channel and fill up your collection, uh, what would you say are your worries that uh, you will not be able to uh, stay in this budget? Uh, <sighs> I'm keeping, I'm really keeping, uh, I think I have, 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 have it written on a, with my worry is, for instance, the shipping is destroying my budget sometimes. Mm -hmm. Like the order we made from France that will come soon. Mm -hmm. uh, I could, I would have been fine to order one or two shirts uh, if there wasn't 20 euro shipping coming with it. Okay. So that's why I said, okay, let's pack on a few more. Uh, and then fortunately they gave me all the discount that the shipping is offset. For me, shipping is one killer. Mm -hmm. and this, has always, always... this has always been, and this is the one thing where I have to say, I feel always a little bit robbed. <laughs> so, uh, the other thing is, uh, you know, when I saw, I showed that, yeah, that yeah, yellow one, another team from England had, it was offering their current shirt, uh, the other day for 20 pounds. Mm -hmm which would be then 25 pounds within shipping, which is an amazing deal. And then I hold myself back. Uh, no, because I don't know how much they want to ask me then at the customs here. Yeah. So well. those are, but you know, to a, I don't see myself buying like crazy. I mean, the last two years and this year, I admit it has been on the crazy part. Mm-hmm. But I find myself, the more I look, I look, look at it, I'm not looking at ah, this and this and this and this and is missing. I see myself more, ah, I'm actually looking good. I mean, I see uh, when the next World Cup comes, I probably will need to add a few Asian shirts. But then I, then I think I'm globally also set fine. Mm -hmm. And, you know, I see it as an end. Uh, you know, there's a tapering off of the rise is coming. Yeah. yeah. It's exciting to build up your channel. It's exciting to um, have to expand your collection. And um, I don't find anything uh, so bad and so sick about it. Mm -hmm. um, if, for example, this stays um, for this um, year and, you know, another year mm -hmm. that you build your collection. Um, if we are talking about... Uh, forever uh, sustaining such a uh, life then that's a different story yes okay i will be, i would have to be living alone well i i so so again to to my question do you see it uh, feasible that uh, with the money you have for yes. this year uh, yes. adding to that uh, some presents uh, yes. for some special occasions mm -hmm. Do you see making the year within the budget and uh, being um, I think I can satisfied with yes it is more I think the budget is very generous mm -hmm. that I have to say it is just that there, there are sometimes where I would need more and where I would need less uh, and, then, and then I also need to bridge the stuff uh, where there is less but I think I can deal with that Mm -hmm. And the, I told you for the, uh, we will tell you that in the unpacking video for this uh, package coming from France, I do have an idea mm -hmm. of how a little bit um, make it not so. 
because uh, there is excitement when you get a new package and you have a new jersey. It's truly exciting, and I think most of my subscribers really see and they love this excitement. I mean, those videos are the ones that are hitting the most mm -hmm. currently, the most likes, which I find a little bit funny to be honest. Mm -hmm. But you know, there's something about this new stuff, and so this needs to be also a little bit spaced out. Yeah, well, it's human nature to. Yes, exactly. Look forward to something nice. Exactly. So I wanna. And then there's always. And, uh, there are two things. There are uh, that two um, impulses that I personally need to learn to fight. The first one is the fear of missing out. That there's a shirt coming out. And if I don't buy it right now, it will never be available. Most of the time I know, wait. Mm -hmm. And I've been rewarded with that a little bit. I know that the one where I probably should have waited is the one for the Maradona jersey. Mm -hmm. Because I realize now that I, I, I could have gotten it cheaper. Yes, you got it really um, very soon the, after he died. And... Yes, exactly. So uh, that was a lesson for me that not everything is... Uh, so this is the fear of missing out. And then, as I said, the other one is to this, uh, now I have it, appreciate what you have for, for, for a while and not say, okay, now, now I have it, check off the list, let's go immediately for the next one. This is where I actually went a little bit wrong. I said in April, I ordered a shirt. I said, when it comes, I ordered all the next one. I should mm -hmm. have... Uh, them out. Nah, because then the, the shipping went too fast and the big, because I wanted every week a shirt arrives. Yes. And then it went a little bit too fast mm -hmm. and I didn't like that. So when you, for instance, hid away my Wolfsburg jersey, this was actually a very good idea. Mm -hmm. Because I really didn't want it to arrive that, that quickly. So you're hmm. also saying that um, there are certain uh, times in the year, like uh, it happened in April, that uh, there is a boom in, on, on the market. The one yeah. can get a lot of things. But then July and August this is not so much. Yeah, so because then feel... they, I mean, uh, uh, it is it is like that. Every season they come up with new shirts. Now are the new shirts being released for 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 the season, and many stores wanna get rid of their current stock. Okay, and this is where the discounts are and coming. And this is when the discounts are coming. And uh, this and this is when you can get uh, current jerseys, new jerseys for a really good price. Okay. Yeah. Meaning uh, half price off sometimes if you get some coupons. I mean, I am literally waiting. Mm -hmm. That sometimes in summer there will be a Nike like last summer when I got the Roma shirt. Mm -hmm. That was uh, initially was 80, 85 and I had it over half price off. And then I got another 20% off and I could push it down to 33. Mm -hmm. Well, maybe. I have two or three shirts from Nike that I want to do something similar to get. Mm -hmm. So uh, now that you're building a community, maybe you guys can help each other yes. into getting good deals yeah, and yeah. into absolutely um, helping helping each other mm -hmm. in yes. this in this way to yeah. stay reasonable within the budget, but um, look for those expand discounts. the collection. Yes. Yeah, but I'm afraid that you know, but this the yellow one here. This one is something that is urgent now. I'm not sure how <laughs> urgent it is. But I think this is something that ought to be bought within the next three to four weeks, I'm afraid. Uh -huh. And I'm really, really not happy about it. So, so, okay, I continue asking this question because I do not get a um, specific answer for which I'm looking for. Um, and you know, it is great that you have um, cool ideas of what to buy next. Yeah. My question is whether you see it feasible that you stay within your budget and still, you know, because I'm learning that some months you are yes. going to invest yes. more than I, others. No. Yes, I can see that. I really want once, I said it the other day, I want to have two too much, but one month next, one month this summer, I definitely don't want to spend a thing. Okay. And, and then, so this would make up already a little bit of the pulled money that I did would make the advance up. that you took the advance would make it in up April. For one, uh, yeah exactly and uh by spending less than towards the end of of, of the year i think i can also achieve that okay, especially because... since my birthday will also come for instance one can say okay october you don't need to spend that much 
Mm -hmm. So basically, you are planning for two months uh, in the uh, upcoming months to, to not spend, so you or can spend half or spend cover more. Yes. for the advance you took in April. Yes. Okay, because in April you took an, an advance mm -hmm. for two more, uh, yes. two additional months. I actually had the thought that really during the European Championships I don't want to spend anything. Okay. Does because the, that, because that is, I mean, that, that, that is from mid June to mid July. Uh, this, this is a time where I, even with my channel, I need to do work. I have projects there and then I want to do the channel with the, and then uh, this day is where my, this is where my energy is beside the family should go. Mm -hmm. So this is where I definitely can, can, can see it. I also, as I said uh, before, if we plan to go somewhere, I can see, okay, this is not reasonable to do uh, spending now. And we have yes, we things. should plan to mm -hmm. have an, a, a vacation. It's out plan. of the question that Absolutely. we are not going to go anywhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so I no, wouldn't no, count no. on this money. Yeah, yeah, no, 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 no. I know, I know. No, no. I, I don't want to count on this money. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So um, you can imagine it without you going into a depression or anything. Maybe this is the time where we are going to see whether you have an, ad uh, an addictive uh, problem. Yes. Mm -hmm. Or, or yes. whether you are just uh, super excited about your channel, we have to leave. Lots of chocolate cake in the in the lean months. <laughs> <laughs> you mean so you are going to uh, put yourself on some therapy for <laughs> to compensate? <laughs> put on a few pounds <laughs> <laughs> well i'm trying to lose a few pounds at the moment mainly yeah. to fit into the maradona shirt <laughs> <laughs> so you bought it expensive and you, you don't fit in it no it is not uh it is it's a tight fit it, it, it's a tight fit mm -hmm. it is no i i absolutely love it it's it's okay. it's a one of a, uh it's one of those where yes i could could have gotten it cheaper now but I, in, in a way, don't regret it because it was so exciting uh, the way it came and how it came and so on. So yeah, that, that was something cool about it. Yeah, I have to say so. But you know, lesson learned. Sometimes you have to be more patient. So now we have some vision on how the year is gonna go. Yes, mm -hmm. we are uh, somewhat content. Yes, um, no real big worries. Mm -hmm. Question mark on depression, will it come or not? No, I don't think it will come. You have other things? Yes, I think uh, if generally, I think uh, dangerous times are always those times of stress or whatever. Mm -hmm. When one needs a little bit more, positive or things. you know, to or if you, you know, and I have this personality. If I've achieved something, then yeah, you need to reward yourself with something. Yeah. You mean with a jersey? Yeah, at the moment this is a jersey. It used to be some music. Now it's a jersey. Mm -hmm. Well, we will think about some other ways to reward. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So yes. Okay. Any more Any questions? I think I'm fine for now. Mm -hmm. I'm generally feeling optimistic with a little concern. I understand. That you may have a real addictive problem, but if so, we have to look for help. Well, at least I'm not <laughs> taking drugs. <laughs> okay, very funny. I'm not drinking Do drugs. Do you have anything yeah, additional to say? No, I think I'm. Um, no, I always have. I I have this collector bug in me. Yes, you do. So this is always something that I wanna. That I will wanna have. <laughs> yeah, you gotta embrace it. That exactly. That comes straight and from we, my family. And we are going to. Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know if control it is the right word, but you know. No, to not let it. Um, yeah, not to keep it overtake you. Yes, exactly, exactly. Okay. I know that you will support me mm. in both directions. In spending. <laughs> no, 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 not only in spending because I mean the the one twenty. This is really generous. I have to say for every month. But also in uh, really keeping me in check because as I I have, I have yet to buy a jersey where I didn't tell you. I'm gonna buy it, uh, you know, mm -hmm. behind your back. Every now and then you would go and you would come with a surprise uh, 
package that I uh, I was not aware that you will buy, but it's not like. Uh, yeah, but this is usually you. It's if, hidden, if, or if, yeah, it's not hidden, and I think I I maybe had one or two where uh, I just bought it because it's also for fifty for fifty fifteen or twenty, and mm -hmm. but I told you, see, this is what I got. Yeah, and let's not forget that you are now building your channel. This is yes, something that exactly. I, I, I completely support. Yeah, yes. right. This is not uh, a lifestyle that uh, mm -hmm. uh, we are gonna maintain for the next no, uh, fifty absolutely. years. No, every no, no, month no, no, hundred and twenty. No. no. There will come a point where you, I hope you will be okay with your collection and you yes. will be getting things here and there, but you know. It's not at, at this rate anymore. Mm -hmm. anyway. I can... mean, I'm always shocked when I saw the last year I got more than 50 new shirts. I actually, I... I <laughs> mm -hmm. And this was the year where I actually I didn't spend for two months. Mm -hmm. to, to well, we find our ways to, to spend some money. Yeah. Me and the girls too, so uh, uh, one needs to allocate yeah. some money for whatever they need. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, you are solely investing it in jerseys right now, so that's what I'm trying. And I'll give you a haircut for free. <laughs> I'm looking forward to mm -hmm. it. <laughs> so, mm -hmm. any other last thoughts? No, that would be about it. You're feeling good about it, though. I think I feel good and confident about it. Okay. I think it's good that you're checking on me and that we put this out. Yeah. That it's out in the open and we should, you maybe you can do something. Yes, this video, uh, I'll, I'll remind you about it if things can no, start getting we, out of control. No, but we can do more videos like this on a regular basis if, to keep me honest. Okay. Yeah? Yes. Not that you're dishonest, but to just no, have no, some to, perspective. Exactly. That, we mm -hmm. call it wife's questions. Okay. <laughs> well, thanks for your time. Mm -hmm, thank you. For I wish yours. you good luck with your um, mm -hmm. channel and uh, your subscribers, and just keep on doing the the great work. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Love you. <laughs> Love you. <laughs> well, I hope you enjoyed this video. Give me us a thumbs up if you did. Drop a line below what you thought about what's happening in that. Subscribe to my channel and we will talk to you soon. Bye. Hey there. I really hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, here are some videos and playlists that you might enjoy too. Also, please consider subscribing to my channel as it will keep you updated on all the things that are rotating in my soccer universe. And with that, I wish you a wonderful day. Bye.